Hey guys, welcome back. In this video, I would show you how to create an account with Cloudy2. So this is the URL which is provided to you. So all you have to do here is click on talk to Cloudy. If you do this, this would pop up. You have two options. One is you can enter an email and continue with it. The second option is just go to your email here. Okay, so let me give my email and yeah and you have to enter your uh, password so let me do that so i've entered my password okay so whatever you have so if you have a two-step verification enabled please make sure you go and validate it's you and after you do that you should have access to cloud e2 and yeah you can enter your full name whatever you want uh, to call it so let me say i'll call it aa and what should i call you call me aa yes i'm older than 18 years and i agree to the their terms and conditions if you want you can go ahead and read it but it's basically it just says uh, you should not use abusive language like all the stuff if you have used any other llm it's pretty much the same so i would not be going over it um, that's basically you what you have to do and if you want you can uh, validate a phone number so let me do that here give me one minute let me just do that so Okay, a text message and let me enter that. It's uh, probably your OTP code. So you can enter that number. So it won't take your Google voice. So it has to be a real number. And basically that's it. And once you are done, this is available to you and you can use it. And it basically says some stuff here. It may occasionally generate incorrect or misleading information or produce offensive or biased content it is not intended to give you professional advice including legal financial medical so do not rely on it it's basically what you read for all the llm that it could hallucinate that's the first one and the second one is whatever uh, input you get from the llm uh, treat it with a pinch of salt don't do not uh, blindly follow it uh, unless you're okay to risk it so it talks about the policy prohibits for harmful use cases, violent, abusive or deceptive content. We regularly review content, flag all this. So additionally, your use cases uh, is covered by terms and privacy. You can read through if you have time. And they are saying they can change the policy. If you want to contest anything, you can do it. And if the uh, content generated was unhelpful select the button and this brings you to the cloudy uh, interface in the next video let's look at it in greater detail i hope uh, the account creation process is now clear to you thank you for joining